Hey guys and gals, welcome to Fire Emblem Heroes Silhouette Prediction Time. Well, eh, it's less a prediction, more kind of obvious. Okay, so, um, it's less a coincidence, more a trend, what they do with New Year's. So obviously, I'm not gonna hide this, it's Liar and Fafnir. We're not, we're not going through this shit. But yeah, so what I'm gonna do is, because we know these two characters, I'm gonna predict the rest of the banner. So, the way it usually goes is, um, because Fire Emblem has a girl bias, um, you are going to probably be the... Let's say he's the on-banner male. So we have to pick one other female and then one other duo out of gen, out of book five. Because they usually do the recent book. Now, Regan is obviously going to be there somehow. Because it's Regan. She is the book five hero, quote-unquote. I don't really know what she... I don't know what her role was particularly. She was kind of there. <laughs> I can't remember. I can't remember shit from that book. And then for other girls, we have the options of Ichri, Dagger, or not. But Dagger and Not does just make a pretty easy duo because they're siblings. And they can, it's like, during your wishes, they can be together and rule. Aww. That or, I don't know, maybe it'll be like <laughs> duo Regan and Not. And then you have um the other one. I don't, I don't fucking know their names. The other lady that isn't Lady in the Trask. The other f big one. Yeah. Th they'll be there. And then for the beast side, she's always... I uh, Liar's gonna be on the banner because she's a girl and she's a cat girl. Also, if you get there's like what th there's a few cat units, but there's only two girls, so it's obviously Liar. Also, we had New Year's left. If you guys don't know, they're twins. But um, with Liar, there honestly can be two possibilities for who it's gonna be, and either way, I think they're gonna be the free to play male. Although, what I'm really hoping is the free to play male. So, um, for those of you who don't know Telius. Um, Liar and Kiza are the subordinates of Ranulf, and in the Japanese version, from what I understand, um, Kiza talks like a, I don't know what they're called, apparently, an Okama or something, like, I think the best would be like a drag queen or something, I don't really know, but he talks very effeminately and is probably implied to be gay, and they kind of have this thing of like fighting over Ranulf's attention, which is funny, because he's the one fighting for Ike's attention, Ranulf, so, yeah, that's kind of unrequited. But it can either be because of that, either we're gonna get New Year's Kiza or New Year's Ranulf. Now, just because he's more popular, I think we might get New Year's Ranulf. Um, but New Year's Kiza isn't an impossibility. Now, I'm hoping, please, Fafnir, do not be the free hero. That's all I want. I want Ranulf to be the free hero because I have Grail saved up. And I will plus 10 in Ranulf. I don't care if his stats are negative 2 and everything. I will go for Ranulf because I love my cat boy. And I love how he loves Ike. Please just make them gay. I guess. Oh, I will say, um, they <laughs> they kept things so fucking vague with the preem paralog. I mean, not paralog. The for forging bonds. They would not say shit on if he was um Ike's descendant or not, or he can disprove that. Let's just say that was for a reason, because they know there's a lot of like shipping bait there. Which I mean, that's why they had the line too, where like Raven was talking about how he loves Lucius, or like whatever the fuck in Constance. But yeah, that's the banner. Um, predictions, you're gonna be a premium, but not the best unit. I mean, um, the duo is obviously gonna be the best. I hope that, actually, I hope the duo is gonna be the best. You're gonna be, like, the other premium. Um, whoever is the book five, that's female that's left, is gonna be, like, okay enough, you know, not bad, not particularly stellar either. Um, and then I hope to God you're on the banner half near so I don't have to deal with you. And I hope the free to play is right off. And that's my prediction for the banner, not for the silhouettes. It's it's fucking obvious who they are. If this is Randolph, not Randolph. If this is like Reinhardt or something, I will eat my shorts. But I mean, who else has the hair that looks like the top, like the bottom half of a George Foreman grill? Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye, everyone.